Hello everyone and welcome to uh, another edition of McCall's Flask and uh, for all you beer lovers I've got a, a, a creature beer for you. This is from Austin Brothers uh, Brewing Company over in Alpena, Michigan and uh, the creature from the Merck Lagoon and it's a, uh, as it says on the can, it's a New England style India Pale Ale. Uh, I'm going to probably destroy what kind of hops uh, they're using there. So Ruka, and uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce this one, E-K-U-A-N-O-T, and also Mosaic Hops. Uh, 7% alcohol, 50 on the BTUs, and, uh, and, you know, as we've done the Austin Brothers before, um, we really like their cool can. This is really, really sharp, nice looking can. Let's show you what the back side looks like, too. Even got the hops on there so you can see how it's pronounced correctly. Today we're uh, in my uh, studio uh, and uh, it's snowing outside. I uh, got our first snow of the fall season. So uh, we're not out in our cigar garden and all that. And uh, the glass today is the 25th anniversary of the uh, Brewers Guild. It's still their 20th, uh, 5th anniversary. So uh, we want to enjoy that. So... Uh, um, you know, we want to right, get right into this, so we're going to pop the tin, pour it in, see what we get. Alrighty. Good golden color. Looks fantastic, and let's get the can go, looking good. Uh, looks fantastic, little... Not really cloudy, uh, I'm going to say, but it's it's not filtered. A little more in there, get it right up the top. And uh, looks like a, a very nice beer. And um, so uh, let's uh, get a smell out of this. Ooh, I'm getting a little bit of pine. Getting a little piney smell right off the top from the hops. And a little bit of grapefruit. Uh, the mosaic is probably giving us that um, grapefruitish. Alrighty, you know I hate drinking alone, so I uh, hope you've got a beer. If not, go get one. And I hope it's a, a microbrew beer or uh, something from a brew pub. So, here's to you. Cheers. Take it to our lips and see what we get. Nice maltiness, not overly dry. Um, surprising being at a 7% uh, alcohol, I figured it'd be a little dr drier than that. Um, the bittering units uh, at 50 are not that bad. Um, there's a little bit of bitterness there, but uh, it's still a nice little uh, flavor, flavor to it. I like it. Um, for me, it's an easy drinking uh, um, um, IPA, New England style. Uh, great color to it. Looks fantastic. Uh, looks great in this 25th anniversary glass. And uh, nice beer from the guys over at Austin Brothers. And if you're familiar with them, um, in Alpena, they've done a fantastic job. They uh, also can it, which makes this available here, here to me over in Traverse City. And... Uh, one of those beers I think you need to take to beer camp or deer camp, depending on how you want to look at it, uh, that kind of thing. So again, a really cool uh, monster. I think your friends uh, would enjoy that. They get a uh, five star on the uh, the can design, and uh, I'm going to give it uh, just shy of five. I'm going to give it like a four point five uh, on the beers. It's right to style, tastes good, uh, great flavor. I'll show it to you one more time, that way you can see. Yep. Fantastic beer. You know, uh, I really enjoy having you stop down. I've added some new things to my uh, YouTube channel. Um, if you get into the community uh, page of my channel, um, I'm doing uh, surveys, what beers you'd like to have me uh, do. Also, uh, I'm, I'm posting the next beer that I'm probably going to review on there, so you get a chance to see the beer um, before I do. Uh, I kind of like that. 
Um, also on my playlist, um, which YouTube just added all that, the, those type of features to, let's say, smaller venue YouTubers. Um, and various places that I've been to, just as an example, like Middle Coast, you can see all the beer reviews I've done in one spot right there on location. So uh, hope you're going to enjoy that. And uh, take the time uh, to, to watch the next video. Uh, have a great day. Hope you're going to have a beer. And if you're going to have a beer, make it a good one.